Hey everybody, I'm Nick Griffin here, and welcome back to Hollow Knight. We entered, uh, we went back to Dirtmouth to buy everybody out of everything. And also do some other things, but primarily to do that. Because I believe the map store is out. Wait, that's not the map store. I'm a dummy. Papanada. Papanada. Yep, okay. Pretty sure everything in here, too. Papa Sude. Okay, nothing left at all. Alright, so we've done that. Which is funny and silly. But good. It means that we are making good use of our Geo. So there is where was it that we can I zoom on this at all? Don't think so. I was under the impression there is a place that we couldn't go before. And I'm trying to remember where it was. We may have already done it. I think we already did it at the end of last episode. Last episode got put got done pretty early because I've spent the last four days at Gen Con, a board gaming convention in Indianapolis. And yeah, that has taken up a lot of my time and prevented me from recording episodes. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. And I think I, yeah, I already came this way. Yep, because that's where we fought the boss. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, that's where we fought the boss. Ouch. Oh, Jesus. I didn't even think about that. That's not what I wanted to do. Some of that spirit back. Okay. So that means something down that we couldn't get to. I wouldn't mind checking that out. I know we need to also get back to the city. But there's a lot of stuff left to explore, so. A lot of stuff left to explore. I kinda wanna explore. This way. Oh yeah, that's right, we have an extra health now. Very nice. We don't need to kill those enemies, but since we can kill them in one shot, it's not all that inconvenient or slow. I hadn't rescued you yet. Good thing I came back this way. I did. I had totally forgotten that we had re that we hadn't rescued him. I thought we had already. That's why it's important to revisit most of the places that you've gone, especially in Metroidvania, because there are reasons to do so. Unfortunately, you get so little geo from them; it's not really worth it. Oh no, this is just the way that has a dead end. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah, shoot, that went up. That's supposed to go down. Whoopsie. Or is this the mines? Yeah, this is the mines. Oh, it's the mines, but I haven't... Oh, right, I don't have the ability that lets me open that yet. Not yet. Doing a little bit of backtracking now and again to make sure you've got everything is never a bad plan in a Metroidvania. Because this was too dark, but that led to Crystal Peak. We couldn't take that elevator. Because it was from the city of T Okay, so let's go down to let's go to the stag station. Let's go back to the city. Luckily there's a stag station right here. Hello there. I believe we want the city storerooms. And away we go. Probably should have just rested on the bench in case I die. Alright. Nice shot. This leads to the elevator that leads to the crystal caverns, I think. Yeah, that's what we got Geo for. I do like how that closes the, uh, closes the doors, but now the door should open up here. And now we can get into the crystal caverns from here, which is very nice. So you can hit right bumper to do that, by the way. Right, I'm not going to go down there immediately. It looks like that was something up there. Oh, just some geo. I mean, it's not bad. Oh, it really is just all the way at the beginning. Really? So I'm doing well. Are you kidding me? God damn, man. There's like nothing I can do about that, by the way. I'm trying, but there's like nothing I can do about it. Oh no, this is sorry, this isn't the Crystal Caverns, this is just dirt map. Just gonna walk slow and trying to not die. Are you kidding me right now? I killed him, but he got me too. It's gonna be easier to go this way, I think. That's why I should have saved with that bench. That was some bull, though. You know, this is really stupid, but... It's worthwhile to actually... 
that's the map shop. I'm gonna keep mis misconstruing these these different buildings for no reason. Apparently that's just the way I do. Just taking a sip right there. Keep, keep the voice fresh. We're going like 100 feet. Obviously, we don't know the size of these bugs. They could be ginormous. In which case, it could be more than 100 feet. But... to get down this way correctly, please. Dash. You can dash if you want to. You can leave your friends behind. Alright. We get to build up some spirit with these enemies, too. Or not, because I'm a dummy. Shouldn't have gotten hit by that, but... That's that, uh, that is another vessel fragment. Of course, while I'm trying to take a sip is when I go down a ledge, I can't walk back up. All right, well. I mean, that's good to know about. Good to have. And back down to the city, I guess. Why does this open? Don't think so. Okay. So what's left in the city that we need to do? Um, that goes to the fungal waste. Obviously, uh, up on the right side of that bench, there's, there's a lot of stuff there still. So. Wow, that's finally mastery of those guys. Longer than I would have guessed. Considering how many we've killed. Well, that was not what I had intended, but that's a nicer place, I guess. Don't need to fight them every time. Plus, we've got a bench coming up, so I'll keep my spirit full. Just absolutely maiming this place. Oh, look, a bench. Sorry if I missed you. Yeah, we already got it, so it's cool. Okay, to the right here. way that I didn't go. Oh, hello. Well, that was easy. I guess that requires you to go to the Mantis Village to get up there. Oh my lord. I do not know what that was, but it was creepy. Yeah, it's 
shortcut. Oh. I guess that's just okay, that's giving us spirit. It kind of feels like an objective or something, like we're trying to be going for it or something. Nice try, but no cigar. Rec record ABBA. The mind still limits us so. How to break past its constraints? To attain a pure focus, is it even possible? Interesting. What's this? Ah, what is that? Oh, that's not an open fast tray. Eh. Oh, and if I had fallen down there anyway, there's spikes on top of this elevator. Which is certainly something to avoid. Ouch. pattern doesn't seem too bad. Yeah, I keep doing that. Oh, really? That's it? Just one? Just one? Alright. Oh jeez. Not my intention to do that, but... Oh, that's the other shortcut, okay. There's another way to go here though, right? An ornate door made from glistening metal. There's a slot for some kind of key. Well, that's funny that I could pull that off, but clearly not where we're supposed to be. Alright, so I guess the right way the first time, but it's good to know that that is in fact the case. Rather than just think that you might be right. I do love the organ music here. I think it fits very well. We do have this very... Grandiose is not quite the word that I'm looking for, but that's kind of what it is. Another one of those assholes going to spawn here. We did just kill one, so maybe not. Heal back up. I really should let sometimes that that uh, healing mellow because if I find a bench, I'll just have wasted soul. This feels like one of those things though that won't uh, have a bench for a while. And there are those little soul canisters that I can harvest from, and these enemies that are like basically useless except for that one, which MVP man, MVP. Oh, I 
couldn't dodge that one. But... Nope, just a ledge. Ooh, nice shot. No! You son of a bitch. Once again, I killed something and was killed by it. Oh god. Okay, this isn't that far away. Oh, that was annoying. We should have been okay there, is the annoying part. Okay, I need to not do this fight. I just want to get there. Don't care. I don't need the Geo. Ooh, since we opened the shortcut, it's a lot faster to get back there. Are you kidding me? I did take a swing at it, and hit it. I'm just gonna ignore this guy. I mean, if they're just gonna stack up, I'm gonna try and blow them up. What the hell? I can only imagine that these things are like failed attempts at creating the other thing. So, like, they've only got like a 10% success rate or something stupid like that. Now if I die... Oh my god. Got it. Except there's gonna be more of those things, so... Oh my gosh, we're going to die again. Your teleporting waves are not appreciated. Got you. Oh, come on. Very intense. My heart rate is definitely being amped up. That's open. That saves us a lot of trouble. Which way? What are these? Okay, well, this was actually good, despite the fact that I almost died there. Let's 
This kind of looks like an area does. Oh god! I was starting to channel. Spell twister. That seems good. I have to wait until I get to a bench to put it on. If it is good. I feel like it probably is. We have almost full soul. Well, this is a boss fight if ever I've seen one. Oh yeah, it is. What's that in the background? Soul Master. Oh god, okay. Oh wow, I just jumped right into that one. Oh jeez, okay. That barely missed me. Well, well bluffed, you asshole. That is such an obnoxious bluff. There has to be a way to dodge it. Oh, dang it. I wanted to dodge to the right. That is gonna wreck me more than anything else. Oh, God. He, that time he did it. Jack. Oh. What? Can't believe that didn't hit him. I can't. I can't actually do anything against that. I actually don't think I can do anything against that. Uh, and the reason I say that... Oh my gosh, we have to go so far. The reason I say that is because... When I didn't jump, he just slammed straight down. <sighs> Would you please not? And I have to kill you... So I can heal. When I was in the air... He did. When I wasn't in the air, he didn't. Really don't like those enemies, man. Starting to dislike them more and more. They teleport when you get close to them, and if you dash towards them, you just... You sacrifice your ability to dodge. But yeah, that's that's the annoying part there is every single time I jumped to avoid the, the first hit He did the second teleport Which I don't know how to defend against that because when I have that second jump Oh my gosh that one literally teleported Okay, fine. I'm just gonna... Oh my gosh, that snipe, though. Problem is, this area is open enough that I'm gonna get lit up. Good. I 
Actually, I should wait and heal. I can only heal twice because my spirit is limited. That's enough to heal again. So yeah, that's probably the big thing I need to figure out about the fight, is how to defend against that. Because that seems like a useful thing to be able to defend against. I'm going to actually come back out here. Max out my spirit. Because, yeah, there's got to be something there. Oh, I didn't check the spell thing. There's got to be a way to defend against that. Maybe just to stand further away from him. there's a way to defend against that specifically. Uh, I'm lucky I managed to poke on him there. Maybe it's just that there's a tell. As to like whether or not he's going to do that teleporting thing. I need, like, my double jump, but I don't have that. That was bad. better at placing myself. Ooh, that was close. Okay. Gosh darn it. Gotcha. That was a little messed up, though. And now for part two. I actually think that I hit him there. This time we got him. Now we have a dead body here to prove it. Desolate dive. Tap B while holding down to strike the earth with a burst of power. Spells will deplete soul, replenish your soul by striking enemies. We already knew that. Alright, so now we gotta get out of here because we can't 
Okay. It is this way. Oh, it's even unlocked. Illumination. So, I see that broken glass, but I want to explore everything else. Because I think there's cool stuff back here. So we defeated the boss, we don't need that. Yep, treasure chest. 380 Geo. Make sure we're healed up, and then I suppose, yeah, we'll strike this. Inflatables. So the other things that are going on down here... Oh, sorry, that's... Yeah. That door is closed. I thought we could just walk out there, but we can't because we need to... Use our newfound ability. Just like that. There's gonna be a lot of these guys around to make sure that we have enough soul to do everything we need to. Um, for some reason, sometimes when I try and cast a spell or do stuff, I get locked in place for no reason. Like, I really don't know why. Because I was trying to move there and couldn't. Hollow Nest Seal. That's some Geo. There is a nice spot right there that's crumbling. That we can get to. Oh. Ah! too far. You have been rescued, ow. Is there some place on this floor that's... Luckily it stopped right at the nick of time. about these guys. Although if I didn't have wall jump they would have just been able to accelerate me past where I normally would have been able to go there because I downstruck on them. Okay, we're underneath the... Oh. We could have struck him with our... with our dream nail. We should have done so. I don't know if that's actually like something we should do. So I have to come all the way back through this. Clearly that's what we're supposed to downstrike right there. And we're back here. Ooh, there's this. Now I get to downstrike all the things. Oh, we end up right here. Cool. All right. Well, we've gotten our new ability that will let us get to new places. We didn't get a key. I was expecting to get a key that let it, would let us into that one room. Clearly not. why. So at this point, we have a couple options. 
There might be something down here. Shut up. I don't care about you, you big beetle. What's this guy? Velmi Arthrid. Velmi Arthrid. Another wanderer's journal. I might not offer a lot for each, but they're plentiful about the caverns, and I doubt you'll find another willing to make trade for Geo. Velmi Arthrid. Velmi Arthrid. Yep, that's another Hellenist seal, all right. The shop will be overflowing with these soon. Gah, I'd never guess so many would still be lying around. They're as common as you make them seem. Maybe I'm offering too much for them. Helma Delica. Hmm, looks like you don't have any relics on you. If you manage to find any in good condition, bring... Oh, that's right, because I don't have any. Damn it. Ow. Make it a simple key. Hold you a simple key? Yeah, sure. Oh. Did I just automatically jump down there? So I think I tried to jump over. Royal Waterways. Ew. I'm oh, sorry, we don't have a map. So we're just going to be wandering blind. There's a bench over here. That sounds good. Let's get a good save in, shall we? This may not have been a wise decision. Oh, I found a bench. Okay, that's a shortcut of sorts. Ow. Man, you're fast. Oh, Jesus. What the oh, goody. So both parts come alive. That took a little bit longer to load than I would have expected. I mean, we're gonna get a lot of soul, but... Oh, Jesus. I can't do stuff in the water. Well, that's just a new thing in general. I'll just do that. Oh, jeez. Thought I was fast, but... Not quite fast enough, it would seem. At least it killed the other half, but oh my gosh, these sewers are savage. Ah, damn it. <laughs> Yikes. This is ridiculous. I mean, I'm okay with it, I guess. Things are not what I was hoping for. Ouch, ouch, they're so fast. This seems to be a recurring pattern. I end up down striking and then landing on the other piece. Oh, those things give soul too. I can only imagine then that they hurt me if I touch them. Takes so long to get through. Okay, no, I can just walk through them. Never mind. Ooh. Okay. This I'm not particularly. Okay, I'm just... 
Oh, holy crap. Oh gosh. Oh man. Right, I'm gonna die. Yep, okay. Son of a bitch. Holy shit. That's rough. Oh wow, it just keeps spawning him too. Alright, well, we need to get back there then, unfortunately. That I forgot that's the way I needed to go. I do not wish to lose all that geo. Out of one vengeful spirit. Yeah, uh, well, I'll never find out now. I kind of want to beat that boss now, but I want a closer bench, is the problem. Now, that said, I can heal, like, all of my shit. With, like, relative ease. They overrun a little bit, that's the secret. The level of misplay here is rather high. Let's look at that boss. It's like a flute worm. So what's this? Okay, just a bunch of geo. Is this a way out? Yes. It's a shortcut. This might save me a lot of time. Yes, it will. Okay. So I can retry this boss a lot faster now. I want to get full spirit before I attempt anything. I think I just need to unload into it. I don't think I'm going to get a chance to heal. I know what I need. Absolutely wrecked. I think I know what I need, though. Alright, well, first off, let's look at our shit. Uh, I don't need the Gathering Swarm. Don't need the Compass. Soul Catcher might be useful. I think I want Thorns of Agony. Fear of the Fallen. When closer to death, your strength will increase. 
That actually might be a real way to go. Uh, man, start those that respectively increase the range of the bear's nail. Oh, that would be really good. And this is Spell Twister. Reflecting the soul. There's a single match of the soul. It improves the bear's ability to cast spells, reduces the soul cost of casting spells. I don't think I need that. I think I want this. Oh, I can't. Dang. I Oh, I only have one left. Okay, I'm not going to worry about Soul Catcher then. I want Thorns of Agony, though, I think. What else is one? Nothing else is one. Maybe I need to come back to this later. When I have more, more stuff. I think I want the Long Nail, maybe. That'll help. It means I'll be able to hit stuff further away. And I think that will be invaluable. I don't know how far it is, but it seems to be pretty far. I can't do shit in the water. That's the real tough part. Yeah, I can't. You can't escape also. This is the other downside. You can't escape from this fight. But I landed in the water, which just ended me. Like, absolutely ended me. There was nothing I could do about that. The question is, can I escape from down here without defeating this boss? I was waiting for you to come back to life. And I made a mistake there. I didn't want to go down. And I have to do this whole bit. What? Oh my god, it was hidden behind the, the, the scenery. die here you lose all your stuff so oh that's right I don't have gathering storm anymore I don't know if I'm good enough to beat this boss just yet I don't know if I have the required equipment Like, I even ha I do have one more health than normal, but I definitely have the wrong strategy, it feels like. But I don't think there's a way out of here is the problem. Actually, no, I bet you I could jump back up. I want to try. Well... I don't like backing down from a challenge, and it's not that fast of a retry time. If I don't screw up, but we- oh my gosh. How long have we been playing this episode? One more try? I think one more try. Yep, I already fucked it up. Are you 
kidding me. I, I... I escaped! <laughs> Holy crap! I once again got locked down for no reason. And I mean no reason. Like, I hit B once to heal up, or to start the channel, and then after that, it was done. Like, I couldn't move. Dang it. So you can't escape and prevent death, but it doesn't, you know, it reduce, prevents boss damage from sticking around. I don't think I have the tools to take care of this. I need something. I think maybe I need another nail upgrade. That's just... You don't have good AoE. There is no good AoE in this game. The thorns, like, maybe that's good AoE, but it's really not that great. Like, it's not make or break here. Yeah, okay, we can totally get back up here. I want to change what we had. I don't want these. I mean, I do want them, but Slaver Compass isn't useful right now, but this is a good thing since we don't... Oh my gosh. It's just, it's right there. It's right at that point where you constantly, where I just happen to land all the time. Alright, so we're at the point where we should probably call it the episode, so I'm actually, yeah, let's just call it Sit on the bench. Say thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I am very much enjoying this game. Obviously, I'm losing track of time while playing it. I will see you next time. But until then, let these terrible sounds haunt your nightmares. And keep your gears turning.